Hi folks, this is so far here. I'd like to show you a little feature that's kind of underneath the hood of mind test that's recently been added. That will be fun to play around and do stuff with after 0.4.14 will come out. This little feature is um, doesn't really do anything without any mods actually using it, but you can still make use for use of it yourself by using the command line and checking the slash days command. This will show you the actual day of mind test that you are in from your server. This day counter here on my s test server here is 188. That means that the sun has set 188 times exactly in this game. The idea is that this counter will go upwards one day at a time, even if you change the time forward or backward properly. So if you go sleep in a bed, sleep through the night, the counter will increase. If I just use the time method to adjust the time to midnight again by doing slash time zero and then typing slash days to check the day counter again, you'll see that it has increased to 189. If I just do this one more time to increase to zero again, then the clock will go ahead almost 24 hours again to midnight and past and we'll now be at 190 days. The nice thing about this method, and this is going to be fun when some of the other mods that will rely on this are going to be finished, including my mods and time regulation, which are both available from my test mods, these mods will be able to implement the seasonal day and night variation. And so you could very well have mods that, for instance, um, modify the day-night cycle to be as if you were near, for instance, the North Pole, where you have an extremely long day and an extremely long night. Depending on how long you def define the year, you could have 20, 30, 40 days of sunshine and then nighttime. Of course, you could also do a moderate um, longitude or latitude, whichever one it is, I al I'm always confused about that, and have a period where day and night are roughly the same, but also have kind of like a wintry feeling where the nights are kind of really long and you only have a few hours of daylight, and summers where the sun almost doesn't set in the evening. Now the way these mods actually do this nighttime and daytime variation is by either speeding up the way that the sun moves across the sky or slowing down the speed. This doesn't really look like the sun always hanging low at the horizon as in real life planets and suns would normally do, but still it gives a very nice effect of the moon at night being there for a very short time or for a very long time. I hope you enjoyed this feature in the upcoming Mind Test release. Have fun and build stuff.